Oh my gosh, you guys did it. You finally did it. Finally. <laughs> uh -huh. Would you like a big pat on the back, please? <laughs> yeah, yeah, right? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> so tell Boy, us about it. How did, the, how did the closing and everything go? It went really good. It was, yeah, it was a long road, but it went really good. Um, yeah, it, it, everything was smooth. They were super happy. We went and did a final walkthrough in the house yesterday. And um, it was really cool because he was like, man, I've been telling people about what you guys do and how you guys saved me $50,000 in realtor commissions. And he goes, this, this is such an awesome strategy. We're just so thrilled about this. And they actually met the lease purchase buyer. And um, ironically enough, they only moved uh, a couple blocks away and they, for whatever reason, I don't even know how this happened, but they hit it off at the lease purchase buyer. <laughs> so and they're like best friends. They're like best friends now. Oh it's the most gosh. bizarre thing. And so they're both just <laughs> like, wow, this it's, they're both super excited. They're both, I mean, we're talking about the buyer and the seller are just, I was blown away yesterday at signing because I had no idea how happy everybody was. <laughs> yeah. Isn't that amazing, right? Like it through really, all that struggle and strife yeah. and now everybody's happy. Yeah, yeah, it was really cool. They are. Everybody's mm -hmm. happy. Our lease purchase buyer is super stoked. Um, he's got a long, long list of things he wants to do to the house. And, um, you know, he just bought a business nine months ago. And so that's why he doesn't qualify for financing yet, but he makes good money. And so he was the perfect candidate. Yeah. So yeah, it went really well. We got uh, we got ten thousand down and ten thousand um, at a later date. So we split up the option deposit for him. So we got twenty thousand down for our option deposit, and then we have about a thousand dollars a month cash flow on this one. Um, a thousand a month. Yeah. Yeah. Five hundred and fifty of that is a um, credit back to him for down payment. So down payment okay. assistance. Yeah, yeah. But, but wow. it's still our money. Yeah. Yeah. A thousand a month. That is awesome, guys. Yeah. Dude, that is a killer deal. So, okay, let me ask you this. You got the checks and the cash in hand yesterday, was it, right? Mm-hmm. Yep. And you're looking at that money, and you're thinking of all the stuff you had to go through to get that. Was it worth it? <laughs> yeah. Yes. For sure. But, but can you can you reassure me just real quick that the first one's always the hardest? Look, man, the first billion is always the hardest. The next yeah. billion dollars you make is that's the easy one. Okay. Oh, so, good. Well, that's yeah, really yeah. Well on the road. Yeah, yeah. So so check yeah. it out. He gave us <laughs> he gave us yeah. cash for his uh, deposit amount, check for the first month's rent, and nine thousand for the option deposit. I love it minus the thousand dollars he gave us to save the deal so yeah. yeah i just think i just think that not having the experience and not really knowing what the paperwork is supposed to look like and not really on subject to deals yeah like yeah. like just because this is just a brand new strategy we've done lots of deals before but this one just with just being different just caused some anxiety and some stress just to make sure that we weren't making a, a huge you know mistake yeah. or any big mistakes so that was the hardest part for us but then you know you know when you go to do something it's like you feel like it's going to be the most stressful thing in the world and you get done with it and you're like oh that wasn't so bad yes <laughs> yeah. so for anybody out there that's feeling overwhelmed once you get to the end you'll look back and go oh well that wasn't so bad yeah, yeah. <laughs> i love hearing that i think that's great well and bronchick <laughs> Um, by the way, he was a lifesaver. So thank you for, for referring him to us. He's been a lifesaver. Um, our state is difficult. I'm not going to lie. It is. And one of his emails to me was pretty funny when he did the lease purchase contract, um, for us, he said, man, your state is liberal. <laughs> yes. Yeah. And it is. So, I mean, there, yeah. it was, that was, that was tough just figuring out what we could do legally in our state and making sure that the contracts were, you know, in line with that. Yeah. Now for everybody who doesn't know, we're talking about Bill Bronchick. He's an attorney out of where? Denver, Colorado? Arizona. Oh, Arizona now. No, I don't think he's an Arizona anymore. It doesn't say that on his oh. signature. He was in Arizona. Well, okay. Yeah. Wherever he is, but he <laughs> is familiar with all these transactions and he can prepare the paperwork and send it to your local title company to, to perform the contracts, right? Yeah, that's what we had to do because Oregon's a title company state and there's literally like no attorneys around here that we could find anyways that will close a deal. They refer everything to the title company. 
Yeah. Yeah. So that's our state specifically. I mean, ideally, like you say, you want to close an attorney, but we cannot do that in Oregon. So yeah. this was that's fine. As, as long as the attorney is representing you and he's preparing the docs that then get executed by whomever, that's right. fine. Yeah. And the only way he was able to do it for us, because he's technically not a licensed Oregon attorney, the only way he was able to do it for us is that we had to sign a document saying that we were not able to find anyone in Oregon to represent us for these deals. Yeah. And all so. that is, is a, a liability between him and, you know, for lack of a better word, the union, the attorney's right. union in Oregon. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's right. what yeah, that is. Totally. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. So, so what, are, what are the big takeaways? Go ahead. Oh, the big takeaways. Yeah. For me, for me, um, the big takeaway was that like creative deals are legit. And they and it's creative is just you can be as creative as you want to be. We're working on a deal right now um, that Don has come up with some crazy creative stuff, and it's like it's like a hybrid of a whole bunch of different things. But it's going to work, and we're going to help these guys, and we're going to put a little jingle in our pocket. And so we're just we got a meeting with them on Thursday. We're stoked, and they're just like super excited because they've got this house for sale for sale by owner. It's gorgeous. And they're not getting any hits on it. And we can come in there and get them more money than they're, than they are asking for the house. Mm -hmm. We can get them money up front. We're going to do a hybrid of a couple different things you've taught us. Yeah. And, so uh, I think the takeaway too has been just like, I, it's opened our minds to be way more creative. Um, so if I could say, you know, really what the takeaway with all this is like, wow, this is possible. And there are tons of different strategies and that confidence has opened up a lot of opportunities for us as well because um, it's just now it's just coming a little easier. We've got we just closed another deal last week. We've got another deal meeting this week, and um, I don't know. It's just getting better. Yeah. Do you find that now that you've got one under your belt, already you're seeing the next one is easier to get and easier to get and easier to get? Yes. Yeah. And why do you think that yep. is? T tell us about that. I think it's confidence. Yeah, I, I think, think it's, I think it's confidence. I think like we've been through it. I mean, we had, I think we had every, almost damn near every obstacle you could have with this first deal, honestly, yeah, <laughs> like, yeah. with the whole, like them trying to get a loan and just so many things. There were just so many things. So I feel like, I feel almost relieved. I'm like, you know what? We can pretty much take on anything at this point. I feel like, you know, yes. we almost killed each other but we're all good. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> yeah, I'm learning oh. to talk a lot less, which is fantastic. Yeah. We listened, we listened to that um, that Joe McCall and uh, and Ron Legrand deal the other day, uh -huh. and I love that because when he answers questions, it's like two-syllable answers every time. <laughs> yes. And, and mine are like multiple pages. Answers. Yes. <laughs> so that was, yeah. a big, that was a big deal for me to learn. But, um, yeah, I mean, I, going forward, there's – it, uh, I think, like you said, confidence for sure, and, yeah. Uh, yeah. and and just having the experience to not be so anxious that we're doing something wrong. Because we've only done cash cash deals and and wholesaling um, and flips mm -hmm. in the past, so you know, <laughs> this just opens up a whole another world for us. Yeah. Do so, you? So when, when I when I did my first terms deal, it was like as soon as I got that first contract and we got the deal and the money in the bank, it was like something clicked in my brain and I was like, I see everything now. Like, is that mm -hmm. yeah. kind of how, what you guys are feeling? Yeah. Like, yeah. Like yeah. your yeah. eyes are open. Like, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I was so worried through this whole thing that they're not going to be happy. These purchase buyers are not going to be happy. The seller's not going to be happy. And I don't know why I had these like thoughts that this, that, that it just wasn't the right thing for them for whatever reason, but everybody's so stoked. Like everybody's happy and they, they, <laughs> It's been a blessing for all parties involved. So yeah, it's just, yeah. It, yeah, it's been great. So here you are able to solve major problems in the seller's life, in the buyer's life, put them together, essentially put this whole deal together. You come away with 10 grand in your pocket plus a thousand a month cash flow, And people are like happy and thanking you. I'm sure. Did anybody mm -hmm. give you a hug? Mm -hmm. Get any <laughs> hugs yet? From no your buyers or sellers? Oh, okay, got, all right. I've got oh. some. <laughs> but, I'm, but I'm a hugger, so. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. God has, that, a, God has a bubble. <laughs> uh, <laughs> man, that is so awesome, guys. Congratulations. I, dude, that is so, I'm serious. Like, 
I know exactly what you're talking about. After you get that first deal done and everything like just clicks for you, it's like, what was I so worried about? Mm -hmm. What was I like, like, why was I making this so hard now? Mm -hmm.